Empire individuals, good morning. God bless us all, man, body, and soul. Today, I want to talk about sexual electric harassment invisibly. It kind of kills me how rape is a law, but Invisible rape, people wouldn't believe them. Now, it's a such thing <laughs> because I am a target of it. Um, I've been there for seven months. Electric, me uh, electric weapon is being used, direct weapons. Um, uh, what I was gonna say, oh, it's so crazy because. You can't sit, well, you ain't even got to sit. You can be standing up. These people is maneuvering in your body, literally maneuvering in your body. I mean, it's really crazy to feel just something, just feel things vibrating on your body. What could be vibrating on your body and you can't see it? Okay, we're going to talk about the sexual and we're going to talk about just the vibration. I haven't really got hip about the vibration because, um, well, actually, I guess I'm going to take a start here. I believe my neighbors was able to enter my home and use the particles everywhere and clothing, everything and my blankets and everything. It's one thing about these house authority that they locks barely lock when you lock your doors. So by that being said, if a person twists your door to right and it was locked and wasn't locked correctly, they're able to enter. And this is how I'm believing that they was able to enter my home without anyone being there. <clears throat> Anyhow, um I don't know if it's the particles that they're using that's able to maneuver the body like that or just me being hacked have something to do with it. But on my clothing, like when I have my cigarettes or my keys or anything or some change in my pocket, it's, it's, it's a vibrating thing going on in my own, like actually in my pocket, <laughs> like where I have my balloons at. Or in my purse is vibrating. It's real crazy because nobody would ever be able to see this. I want to see if I can ever catch it of a feeling. Somebody can just feel the vibration that's going on in in a pocket where my belongings at. Okay, so now, like, um, I can be able to. I'm I, I'm able to stand and I'm being violated in a way sexually that. I'm not really feeling like that, but I, you know, I know that it's some something is happening. It, it's it's hard to understand, but it's true. Like you being bothered by something that you can't see, that is bothering your areas that you know no one there is to bother. But it's feeling like little. Um, I don't know. It, it feel more controlling. It feel more controlled, more controlled, because it's it's hard to explain the 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 feeling that that is giving you, like it's something crawling up on your skin, like some crawling between your booty and through your little hairs and stuff, or your coochie with all your hairs and stuff. Just this real shit. This is what this seemed like it's feeling like. And then something feel like it's just going up inside you. Like, how can this shit happen invisibly? Like, I understand that they say that it's in our skin that we can't see it. But, so is things being maneuvered under our skin that, that really that we can't feel but don't, I mean, can't see but only feel? I mean, this is some real shit. How somebody able to go into your rectum and pull out shit. Or go in your vagina and, 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 you know, 
motherfuckers smelling pussy. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's real crazy how this has happened, how they able to make you fart. And then here go you a feeling of sh feeling like you got a shit. Shit is actually being maneuvered in your body and you can't see it, but you're being violated as a human being and as as your rights just being took it invisibly. Like it's it's really sad how you in a shower and you feel things touching you and it's only you there. You know you ain't fucking crazy. It's only you there, but shit rolling up your ass. Like I didn't felt I didn't brush my teeth. When I brush my teeth, sometimes I like to lean down over the sink. I felt something grab my ass. It's nothing there. Just like grab a just pinch your ass. Like you got just like if your man was right there and he just tapped you on your ass. That's how it was invisibly. He sits on the toilet. I feel I, I sit on the toilet. I feel things. I feel like things being maneuvered. Like I, I can sit on my bed and feel like they are maneuvering in my stomach. How in the fuck can something happen? Ain't no motherfucker crazy. You know when something touching you. I'm just like to the point of how, how are they able to be in your body literally like this in your organs and and shit like that? Your uterus. I mean like. They actually say that they be fucking me and I'm not, I don't feel nothing like that, but I do feel like, it, um, I ain't gonna even say pressure, like something just pushing up against you. You can't feel it. It's not really being, it's not really a dick, <laughs> you know, inside the pussy, you know, I feel a person pushing up on me. I'm, a, I'm I'm not a touchy touchy person if I don't want nobody to touch me it's not gonna happen so I, for me to be there in by myself and is this this shit happen visibly who the fuck is touching me but it's I know it's my neighbors maneuvering shit off their computer I know that for a fact. And can nobody tell me no different? Uh, I know that they can record the voices and play the voices because they play like their kids. They, I don't give a damn. I don't give a damn about none of that. They play like their kids. They play like my sister and them said something or my dude said something or my sister said something or my mom and them said something or my brother said something. They always on some shit like that, but they record the voices. Okay, fine, and Danny, I done got hip to that. But the sexual thing, I mean, it, it's not a stimulation. It's none of that. It's not a, I'm feeling sexual because they touching me. Fuck no, I feel violated. I, it's not a good feeling. It's not a, a feeling that makes me want to come or something or, you know, something of that sort. No, it, it's a violation. Like, why are you touching me? Like, why are you in my ass? Like, why are you pushing up on my ass? Like they said, they fucking, they probably is. I mean, probably is. I don't know. But I don't feel penetration. I don't feel none of that. I don't feel them like I feel my real, my dude. <laughs> With the feeling and, and pleasure, man, and, you know, excitement and shit like that and so on. This is shit invisible that is not even, not even likable to me. I mean, I don't get nothing from this. I try to make me swallow my gum. These people is ludicrous. These people is so fucking ludicrous. I, I can't believe this the type of shit a motherfucker pull. Like I said, I know who's in my vo in my head. Not only that it hacked into my body, it's my neighbors. I can't stress this enough. I can't stress this enough. This is my neighbors in the projects. This is how they, I guess, I don't, I don't know what kick they get out of it. Because my understanding of this, this shit that, that's next door, that's doing this, baby. Ain't right worth the shit.
pussy probably on that bed. My hate. So, sorry for my little mess. Uh, <laughs> this is the working office. But, um, this is sickening. This can't be made up. And for people making this shit up, you a sad individual. You really need to be a target. You really should be able to go through this shit and know what it is to be bothered invisibly. This is not a game. This is people bodies. Who knows probably what they are fucking injecting in you since they able to maneuver in your body. How you how we not know that they not injecting us with something? I mean, this is sickening and no one really trying to hear this shit and this is real. I promise you on oh, Jesus. Jesus will will expose this. He will. I tell you for them people out here faking, this is no joke. You really should be a target. You is one of them that should be a target. Since you want to fake that somebody's invisibly bothering you with electronics. But it's actually people are being bothered as such as myself and others. With perbs and people that that's messed up. That, that ain't got no life. That, that ain't worthy than us. On no levels. I'm just still where I at. I'm still thinking in the same mind. That they're mad because I'm not. No. I'm not. I don't have to be your friend. <laughs> I don't. I'm not. You're not going to make me. I don't care if you is in my body or you hacked. And you're still not going to make me be your friend. You're still not going to make me like you. You're still not going to make me jam with you or anything or such. No. I didn't want to. I'm not going to. But I will come back and all my uh, empowered individuals are staying. Let's mean, be meanful about this. Let's be honest and truthful about this. Tell it how it is and tell it what's going on. If things happen sexually, please put it out there. Everybody needs to know because I believe that it's all type of the same symptoms of everybody going through. Of electronic magnet harassment rape. Because that's really what it is. It's rape. It's not consensual. It's not even fun. It's not even exciting. It don't even make you get off. <laughs> I ain't with no invisible shit. And that ain't gonna never make me feel like. It's somebody that's really there and they ain't. I got my own motherfucking imagination. If I wanted to use it. That's what I do. To make that motherfucker happen. It's real shit. Let's take heed. Let's stand up. Let's be for the real one, huh? I'm not finna sit and play with nobody. I don't got time to be on YouTube about some shit to be made up. I got better things to do with my time. Now, I'm only a woman. I'm a mother. I got a household to tend to. I don't have time to be on YouTube making up videos. So if you on YouTube making up videos, you need to be one of them victims. Because you're not really going through it for real. They're not in your body. You're not getting shocked. They're not up and down your legs. They're not in your stomach, in your back, in your arm. Staying, stinging you in your head. This is real. <laughs> 